Double chocolate milk be banned in schools. The Department of Agriculture or the USDA is considering removing flavored milk from elementary schools. The concern is the amount of added sugars in children's diets. Dana Smith has details on the proposal. Milk is a decades old staple at school cafeterias across the country, but officials at the Department of Agriculture are considering a ban on flavored milks. Not everyone agrees. I prefer chocolate milk over white any day. According to the Federal Register, which is like a daily journal from the federal government, this new proposal comes amid concerns over the number of added sugars in children's diets. However you have to get it in them to drink it is what you need to do because it's good for them. One USDA proposal says flavored milk like chocolate or strawberry milk would only be available for high schoolers. Elementary students would only have access to fat-free and low-fat white milk. When we look at the total consumption of sugar in our kids' diets, most people would be astounded. Children's Hospital of the King's Daughters Pediatrician and co-chair of the School Health Committee for the Virginia Chapter of the American Academy of Pediatrics, Dr. Leah Rowland said parents might be unaware of just how much sugar their children are eating in a day. And when you look at the average in a chocolate milk, 17 grams in a serving. Nothing is set in stone just yet. Another USDA proposal would keep flavored milk for all students, but with a limit on the number of added sugars to no more than 10 grams per cup. I think they should have the strawberry and the chocolate because people get tired of the same old stuff all the time. According to the USDA, flavored milk is the leading source of added sugars in school lunch and breakfast programs. For 13 News Now, it's just milk. I'm Dana Smith. If the USDA does decide to limit flavored milk, it wouldn't happen until the 2025-26 school year.